Okay, everyone. Oh my god, the lighting. So we are in our stateroom. We ended up getting an ocean view stateroom because we needed a little bit of light. We've been doing interior staterooms every time we uh, have been cruising, but we decided this time we were going to get some light in here because being in an interior sometimes you don't know what's going on. A normal, like our interiors, sorry, a little blurry. Here we have our closet, which has um ample space and we have some drawers down there so we'll be able to do that right next to it is our bathroom which is your standard royal caribbean bathroom we have this we don't have is, do these open ah yes they do so there's some room here and then you have your hair and body wash two in one okay we have a full length mirror. Oh my God, mirror, I see you Richard too. You can't hide from, from the freaking mirrors, I swear. Okay, so then we have an announcement channel. We have a couple things here. We have two, um, uh, what's it called, outlets here. Um, I didn't realize there were no outlets near the bed. On Odyssey, there were outlets near the bed. Then we have more storage here. We have drawers. We have a mini fridge if need be. We have more drawers, a full length mirror, and then this is one of those adjacent rooms so we just have to make sure that's locked at all times because there's somebody else on the other side. Um, and this is the main feature. Oh, and those also of course we have a television which I don't know if they have, I don't think they have chrome which sucks. Odyssey had chrome, chromecast, so it's okay. Listen, not all of them are going to be perfect. Anyways. So this is our bed, two queens pushed together, one end table, another end table with a phone. This is our view for now. It's gonna be so nice to look out here. Oh, that's our view, so cute. Love that for us. So we are at the bar and um, we decided to YOLO and get the drink package instead of just having the soda package. So we're getting a refund on our soda package and to drink to this occasion, we have a B54, B52, not 54. I keep saying 54, B52 shot. And then Richard's getting his Crown Royal, but we're waiting for it. Bottoms up. Okay guys, so we just go back to the room because I had to pick up my motion sickness patch that I wear throughout the entire cruise. But we had a couple of drinks at the, don't know what the English pub on here is called, but we went and had a couple of drinks, but we realized that we're moving, so we have to go topside to go and join the sail away party. But look, we're moving! we got our bags and it is currently what time is it it is 5 30 so not too shabby getting our bags i feel like we always get our bags kind of late we are gonna go ahead and unpack a little bit and then we're gonna go to dinner because dinner is at 6 30 tonight in the main dining room all right everyone so it is now evening time and we are about to go to 
some dinner so I just changed into a leather jacket and put on my fanny because we finally got our luggage so fanny leather jacket let's go get some grub everyone we need the button to make sure that the lights are on so let's now introduce to you the man in charge of all the hotel operations here on board the ship everybody let's welcome to the stage our hotel director Alistair not a big red button and as you can see Captain James he has the button over there that is a big red button so should we do a countdown yeah perfect let's do a countdown everybody nice and loud let's start with a 10 9 Playmakers early, which is always gonna watch the game here, but I was gonna be out on the deck sunbathing, but we decided not to do that and we're here at Playmakers to watch the soccer game. It is US versus Iran. So I'm excited about it. I have a bubble water. We're gonna order a couple beers. I'm actually gonna read for a little bit. Hey 
everybody, so we are off to dinner now. It is the first dress to impress night, so I'm wearing a little metallic number. Got my makeup done, did my hair in literally 10 minutes because we were rushing. But yeah, and then I put a little sparkle guy on so I can be a little sparkly today to match my dress because I'm feeling very metallic. Don't mind the kids that are next door because they're really, really, really loud. Um, but lucky for us, they sleep when we sleep, so it's great. Um, anyways, uh, we are off to dinner. We're going to Hooked, which is the seafood restaurant on board. And let's go ahead and get started with tonight's festivities. we have a little thing saying we're going forward which is fine because the app updates itself so we don't have to do anything somebody lost some luggage so that's not fun um the are details promise visit okay so we are actually not getting off the ship tomorrow we decided that we're gonna just enjoy what we have going on in the ship because a lot of people will be off the ship cabo san lucas isn't like one of our like must see destinations we're really excited for puerto vallarta and super soaked for Mazatlan because we have awesome excursions. But Cabo seemed to be just kind of like me. I don't know. If you guys think of any, I don't know. I just, I'm not like obsessed. But I am obsessed with Puerto Vallarta. 
and Cabo. We have some amazing excursions coming to you guys. I feel like the freaking cruise director. But yeah, so we have that. So we are actually just doing a chill day tomorrow, but we do have reservations to do the escape room on board, which is so exciting. So we will be adding those videos to this vlog as well because we are not getting off the ship um i'm doing a bunch of different like vlogs for the other um places that we're going to but we're gonna be adding cabo doing a uh, cruise day while people are in cabo so it's not as crowded because it is at full capacity here which is crazy i think there's like 35 hundred people on board right now which is insane because the last cruise we went to as you know if you watch that cruise um there was only like I think it was like a 25 to 30 percent capacity there was like nobody on board which was like so nice but here we are back at max capacity off to change into my slippers and go to the it's called like it's the duck and something else but it's called the copper and clover i think on the ship it's the english pub so we're gonna go over to the english pub hang out there all right we're gonna just do the shots what? Two shots? Okay. Straight two shots. <laughs> Good morning guys and happy freaking day three from Navigator of the Seas. Uh, today's actually a port day. We are in Cabo, but we are not getting off the ship. We are going to enjoy things that we might not have been able to do while everyone was on the ship because as I mentioned previously in this vlog, um, this ship is packed. There's about 3,500 people on here. Um, so we are taking advantage of people going to Cabo today. Um, I don't, yeah. Anyways, so at 10.30 we actually have escape room. Hopefully we'll be able to do it because you have to have a minimum of six people. So hopefully four more people are looking at the 10.30 time slot like we are. Um, or at least, yeah, it has to be a minimum of six people. Um, but right now we're going to go over to the Cafe Promenade. Yes, we're going over to the Cafe Promenade because i need some coffee uh obviously i am not showing you guys gym today because we actually set our clocks forward so it's actually 9 43 and not 8 43 in the morning um so time got kind of messed up which is fine because as you guys saw yesterday rosa partied hard yesterday so we are fine though we are doing good this morning i just need a little coffee my brain needs to start working because we're doing the escape room and I need my brain to somewhat function because I am not the best at puzzles, but I will have a good time nonetheless. Um, we're also gonna try to do a bunch of other stuff. So anyways, instead of just rambling, I will go ahead and show you guys everything we're gonna do. We might not be able to show you the escape room because I don't think they allow cameras in there to keep it like together so nobody really sees what's in there and doesn't have all the answers, but I'm sure there's like stuff online that you can look up if you wanted to. Um, yeah, so we're gonna go and I will take you guys along with. Alright guys, so we are here at the Windjammer. We just finished. 
finished um, the escape room and it was super fun. We failed. Um, and there was just too much going on. There was about 12 of us in there. And it was really cool. It was um, observatory themed, which was awesome. Um, but we are actually in Cabo San Lucas right now. I don't know if you can see gonna show the islands yeah um, but we are eating at the windjammer right now I'm having a little of this and I got a little cheeky dessert and some water um, and then after this we're gonna go take a few photos and then um, change to go up on the deck So we came back to the room to quickly change because we're gonna go on the water slides, but look at the view from outside our window. So gorgeous. So pretty. Love that. We're gonna go up on the deck. It is such a beautiful day today. Thank the maker. And yeah. All right guys, this is, is the beach fit, AKA top deck fit. We just have this little mini cover-up. The swimsuit itself is from Kapshi. Then of course, oh Jesus, and there goes the boat. <laughs> um, and then we have our sandals by Airy. But yeah, this is just. Fresh. We just had some suntan. It was really good, but now we're gonna have a little stitch that I made, and they finally. Have All right, now normal. So we are on the ship. Thank God we didn't get off on Cabo because low key it took forever for people to get off. I think they're still getting off, which is crazy because it's already 2:20. Um, but we have a little snack here. I wasn't gonna get a lemonade, but then I kind of felt like it, so I got one. Hi everyone, what is up? So it is clearly nighttime now. We just got ready to leave the cabin. I just, it's, I'm just wearing the same outfit but with a denim jacket on. Um, I'm probably gonna be filming the rest of the night on the phone. I just don't wanna bring the camera with me right now because I will be bringing it with me to Mexico tomorrow and I wanna be able to just like save some batteries. So yeah, we're gonna go get a drink and then we have our Mai Tai dining at 6.45 and then we have a show at nine o'clock. We have a lot going on, but let's go get some shots first. <laughs> 